Hey guys, it's Gingerly and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Sims 3 renovation for you. This is um, Myrtle Bungalow, I'm pretty sure is what it's called. <laughs> um, and this is actually not the renovation I had planned for this week. Um, not that I really planned them, but this week has been a hot mess for me, guys. I almost thought, I was going to say considered, but no. Um, but for a minute there, I thought that there probably was not going to be a build up um, today. And so I was kind of stressing out a bit, but obviously it's all good. <laughs> um, no, but I had actually recorded a different video and um, yeah, <laughs> my recording software just decided, I don't even know what happened. It just, it was a hot mess. It just like, it wasn't responding <laughs> pretty much and um, I had pretty much almost finished the entire like renovation as well um, and then you know a few days later I found out that I do actually indeed have the footage somehow it like held on to it for a few days and um, yeah I think it's kind of corrupt though so I'm gonna try and save it so maybe you'll be able to see it I'm not sure um because I did do pretty much the entire house I think I had like a bedroom and a bathroom left and I just figured like you know there was no point in continuing that house and not having most of it to show you so I decided to start on this one um instead but I'm gonna try and save the other one just because I actually do prefer that over this one um I actually really liked it but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to save the footage. So I don't know. Let me know what you want me to do with it. Like, would you want to see it? It's kind of like, um, I'd say kind of like a modern industrial kind of like house. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but um, yeah. So if you want to see it, I guess I could just like kind of like, show you what it looks like and then continue it but I don't know if it would be worth that um just because there is hardly like anything more to do if you know what I mean like it's literally just a bedroom and a bathroom left for me to like renovate so I don't know um but I guess I could like do it like as like a bonus video or something I'm not sure Let's see um but let me know do you want to see it not um, I'm going to try and save it and if I can that will be the next renovation but we'll have to see. Um, but anyway this house um, I wanted to renovate in a way that I hadn't before. I feel like um, I've kind of been getting stuck in renovating, well not renovating but like building or whatever in the same sort of like styles like there are a lot of different decor themes and stuff and um I feel like I, I don't always do the same I feel like I'm pretty good at being able to like mix it up but I feel like I've done a lot of the different styles now and so I'm kind of getting to a point where I'm like okay how can I make this different um you know because I don't constantly want to be using the exact same things in the exact same way and so I decided to try and go for kind of like a bohemian bohem, uh, bohemian style <laughs> but um, I feel like that was really hard to do in The Sims 3 <laughs> um, and I, I didn't have time to look for like custom content that would work in that way just because of that whole build disaster that this week has given me. <laughs> um, but I tried to do the best I could. Um, like, I know this isn't, like, perfectly bohemian. It's kind of a mix with that and just, like, kind of old-fashioned looking stuff. But I tried my best, so, like, take it with a grain of salt. It's not, like, perfect, but I wanted to add, like, a slight bohemian sort of, like, vibe-ish. But, again, I'm not really, like, an expert <laughs> on that kind of, like, decor style. Nor am I on any, but I feel like, you know, with some of the others, it's a bit easier. But I wanted to do something a bit different. So, hopefully you guys like it. Um, it's not my personal style, for sure. But, um, I don't know, it was kind of fun doing something a bit different. So, I guess some of you may look at this and be like, yeah, this wasn't really much of, like, a, a makeover. But I don't really do these videos as... 
I guess like a makeover kind of like sure it's a renovation but that doesn't mean that's necessarily like oh let's make this look as modern and as beautiful as we can get it no I kind of I just want to mix it up and kind of like try new things and I don't know I, I guess some of you will probably understand and maybe some of you won't but that's cool um but yeah this was like a nice kind of smaller house um I purposely chose a smaller house because if you saw my last build um that was like a huge one um that was so big it was like pretty much like a mansion <laughs> and so I decided that I wanted to just tone it down a little bit so I hope you guys like it um yeah I kind of struggled it was kind of hard like I wasn't really sure where I was like going with things but I was just having fun with it so um yeah and I was trying to use things that I haven't before um I mean originally I was like oh maybe I could kind of make this like a starter home but um I ended up like looking at the price of it at the end and being like yeah that's that's not a starter home <laughs> um I'd say more of like a second home <laughs> but um yeah I feel like it didn't put that much in it though so I'm really not sure what costs so much I mean maybe it was like I don't know maybe I did use like some more expensive things but didn't realize I don't know I'm really not sure but um yeah so we had this like weird space near the entrance and I wasn't entirely sure what to do with it um but I just decided to leave it kind of more open and just kind of make like an entryway so yeah I actually feel like this house is quite spacious compared to a lot of other um like smaller houses in the sims like whether that be sims 3 or sims 4 um I feel like this one was just quite spacious like look at the living area that's huge like usually they're so cramped and it's really like it's not hard to put things in there but it's definitely not as easy as just being like oh let's just put some furniture in wherever I want like you know you kind of have to think it out more and so um yeah it was it was nice in saying that I did increase the size of the bedroom a bit because I felt like it, I hate when the roofs like like I don't know how to explain it but they cut through like the walls of, of the exterior like it's hard to explain um you may have seen it you may not have it doesn't matter so I got rid of that one roof and um like expanded the house a bit so I could make it look different um even though the bedroom was already huge but it made the bedroom bigger which was not really my intention it was more just to like for aesthetic purposes from the outside um so here's what I mean like in the oh, well, it doesn't matter <laughs> um but yeah so I I think that looks good but um yeah the bedroom was huge now and I kind of considered like splitting it a bit I was like oh maybe I should you know make like an ensuite bathroom but then I was like for one bedroom do you really need two bathrooms probably not so I just decided to leave it and I kind of um make it more of like a useful area <laughs> I don't know but an area that you would you know do stuff in <laughs> you'll see what I mean um but yeah I had fun with this bathroom I used that like yellow bath <laughs> um just because I was like oh that kind of like fits in with the theme I wanted to use like a bunch more like colorful items and I mean, not all of them are colourful, to be fair, but I just, I wanted to use things that I hadn't necessarily used before, but at the same time, not really, um, but I was having a lot of fun with those, like, lights, you know, those, like, candles and stuff, I thought that was kind of cool, I never really get to use them because I feel like, um, you know, they don't usually fit in with, like, the aesthetic of what I'm trying to go for, but in this case, I was like, these are perfect, <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, that was fun and I feel like picking the wallpaper was such a struggle just because I was like you know I feel like bohemian why can I not say that bohemian is kind of like colorful-ish <laughs> but um yeah so I just I wanted to do something colorful but it's kind of hard because I don't know I'm not sure it was just it was difficult <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with it <sighs> okay 
Um, yeah, and then same with, like, picking rugs and stuff. Like, I don't know. Again, just picking, like, swatches and stuff. But I did it. I think it's okay. Again, it's not, like, my favourite house or anything, but I just wanted to do something different. Um, I feel like building the same thing over and over again just gets very repetitive, obviously. <laughs> and, um, you know, it's just like not that interesting. So I think it's quite fun just to do some different things. And here's what I'm talking about with like the extra space. I just put like an easel and like a little couch, kind of like a little hangout area, but like not really, if you know what I mean. Um, I just, I thought that kind of filled up the space nicely without like making it look really like cramped and crowded so yeah and then we move on to the outside now I don't usually do too much to the outside in renovations like just because I can't really be bothered like I don't mind landscaping but like I'm not that good at it <laughs> like I don't know I'm just I don't think of these things like I don't know I'm sure if I really wanted to I could like do something cool but most of the time it's just not really my first priority <laughs> so I think I did okay like I just put in some more flowers and stuff and kind of made it look a bit more colorful just because you know the house has a lot of brown tones so yeah but anyway guys we are approaching the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more videos and um yeah I'll see you next time but um, also don't forget to let me know if you want to see that other build if I can and a variation of it. But anyway, bye.